Welcome back, JJ's Great Gamers, to another video. It's your host here, JJ. So as you see in front of me, I have an iPhone 10, an iPhone 7 Plus, and I have the box of an iPhone SE, because unfortunately I do not no longer have that phone. I know you're going to say that the red iPhone doesn't come in the black box, but this is just a broken iPhone 7 Plus, because the iPhone, uh, the black, the jet black version is uh, filming this right now. So. Here we have, oh, uh, you can see I got some notifications from Instagram. Here we have the iPhone 10. Comes in this nice box. When you open it up, it says designed by Apple in California, like all the products do, and it comes with the headphones and the charger. It also comes with the dongle. So, yeah, it's a nice phone. Like, it takes a little bit to getting used to. I don't think Steve Jobs would have liked it because you, uh, when we called Verizon to customer support, he said that on the first day he got a ton of calls because people didn't know how to turn it off. It used to be so simple. And this front screen of this one's broken. So yeah, this is just like... So the first iPhone I got was an iPhone... Yeah, the iPhone 5C, yeah. The plastic, cheap one. But hey, I had that phone for like a good year and a half before I upgraded to this phone, my iPhone SE. And I had this phone for... It was... I got the iPhone SE the first day it came out. That was... It's like March 2016. And if you follow my Instagram, you know I got this jet black iPhone 7 on my birthday this year. So yeah, but uh, but this ma the video is mainly here to talk about the iPhone 10. So yeah, it's all glass except for the sides, which are made out of stainless steel, which uh, gives it pretty good drop protection. The case I use is this Pelican case. It's very strong, like everything resistant, so that's really nice. Um, it's waterproof. The phone itself, probably the thing that I dislike, I'm just trying to clear some of these notifications. So yeah, here's, so yeah, probably the biggest thing that you'll have to get used to is the top sensor bar. It's somewhat obstructive, but in other ways not, and it just is a lot like, it's just different from every iPhone ever, because you know, because it doesn't, it barely has any bezels, and it actually kind of feels like the Jet Black iPhone 7, that like glossy, slippery material, so I suggest definitely using this with a case, because it's very slick, and since it's glass, a fingerprint magnet. So, it's pretty expensive for this phone, but if you have the money, I suggest getting it, because it's just a really nice phone. Like, you can feel like the quality. And like, even like the antenna bands, they just like, blend in perfectly. So overall, I rate this a 9 out of 10. Very nice phone. And most YouTubers at this point would either probably... Most tech YouTubers would throw it off a building, but because I'm not making $10,000 a video, I am not going to go and throw my brand new phone off a building. So that, I'm sorry for that. So yeah, that's all for now. I will see you guys in the next video. JJ.